Incoming transmission. Incoming transmission. Incoming transmission. Data connection established. Syncing with host computer. Beaming information. Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Alex. I'm 23 years old. I use he, him pronouns. Um, I live in New Jersey, and I am currently working as an audio engineer and a music instructor. Although, at the time this game starts, that might change, because I might be switching up uh, some of my jobs, which I'm kind of excited about. Uh, kind of a long story, if you want to know the full story, uh, ask me and I'll probably tell you about it. Um, <laughs> all that aside now, um, I have been playing games for about a year or so now, time's really flying by, and I thought it was going to be a little longer <laughs> until I came back to survive to the Survivor format, but I just couldn't resist the opportunity to play Inferno. Um, I really love this cat, this, excuse me, this prod team. Um, I really like the theme of the season. I think it's going to be really interesting to see, you know, where the game goes uh, with all that being considered. Um, some stuff about me. I'm really big into, you know, reality TV show competitions, Survivor, Amazing Race, Big Brother, all that stuff. Um, I'm super big into m music and movies. I play a bunch of different instruments. I write music. I compose music, um, all that good stuff. And I love talking to anyone about anything pop culture related, movies, music, or anything like that. So if you want to talk to me about any of that, talk to me about that. I promise I will be happy to talk to you um and I'm just really excited to start this game see who's playing see what happens and yeah can't wait to meet everyone see ya hello my name is Allie G and I am 59 years old I am a mother to a 33 year old daughter and a grandmother to two little girls, ages six and four. And thanks for inviting me to the game. What you can expect from me in this game is, A, I'm gonna have a lot of fun regardless. B, I won't give up. I'm not the greatest at the ping pong balls and the solo cups. I used to play alias games years ago. But I always embrace learning something new and I also embrace meeting people from the younger generations. I think it's very important. But anyways, thanks again for inviting me and I am going to have a blast in the game. Hey, what's up? My name is Bruce. I'm 31 and I'm from Dallas and I am a basketball coach and an English teacher and I'm excited to play this game. As you can see, I'm currently making this video while I'm driving, um, which probably isn't the smartest thing in the world to do. So if you're at home, don't do that. Um, but I think that it, one, shows my uh, willingness to live dangerously, and two, my ability to do more than one thing at one time. And I think both of those things are gonna be the reason why I'm gonna be successful in this game. Uh, you know, I've always been super athletic and done the sports thing and all those things, played college basketball. And I think that's a big part of me, but I think the thing that, you know, makes me unique is not only do I, or did I play college basketball, but I also did theater all throughout high school and even some in college. Uh, and I was interested in other things outside of sports, which is something that you don't always see from people that are involved in sports. So I think that's something that uh, benefits me because I feel like I can relate to a lot of people and I can uh, be somebody that people can trust because it does seem like anytime I'm around people, that is something that kind of comes about. You know, I've played in a game before and I was a little bit successful because of that, but also in that I can be seen as a little bit of a threat. So I'm gonna try to not to come on too strong right away, but I know that uh, my personality and my willingness and wanting to be in charge and call the shots uh, sometimes uh, gets me in trouble because, you know, if I feel like you're doing something wrong, I'm, I'm probably gonna tell you about it. So I got to uh, I got to try to 
rein that in and be able to uh, make those connections, make those personal connections and get people to trust me without, and, and get them to do what I want them to do without uh, acting, without them knowing that they're doing what I want them to do. And I think my personality can do that. And I am hoping that I will be able to have some success in that. Now I'm gonna sign off uh, because I just got on the freeway and it's definitely not safe to do this on the freeway for those of you at home again. Um, and when I make it home and this game gets rolling, I think you're gonna see my ability in the game to multitask as I am in this video uh, is going to come to light. And when I'm on finale night and I've won, I will mention this video and the fact that I drove in a car while giving my about me speech. So thank you. I'm Bruce from Dallas, and I'm looking forward to winning this game. They said we could talk about anything, but I don't know what to talk about. Oh, rewind, rewind, let me start. My name is Chris Ann, and I'm 25, and I'm from Jamaica, but I live in Canada. Yeah. What am I gonna talk about? Um, I like to cook, but I also like to eat. I like to eat more than I like to cook. I'm not, I love some food. Um, don't let the homelessness fool you. I, I, I put on a front. I look like this during the week, but on the weekends, I look like a patty. Um, my favorite color is green. Like, I don't know what I'm supposed to talk about. And I hope I'm not the one in person who didn't, like, they said talk about anything. I don't know. I'm excited to play with y'all, get to know y'all. Yeah. <laughs> hey guys, my name is Corey. I'm 20 and I'm from Colorado Springs, Colorado. I am here in Inferno Season 3 so I can slay and get another win, hopefully. Um... Yeah, um, <laughs> I don't know why I said it like that. Yeah, um, if you guys don't know me, great, as you should. Um, I'm not the most relevant person ever, but I've been around. I've been dabbling here and there. Um, yeah, <laughs> sorry, not me like opening this camera and deciding I'm not going to decide or think about anything that I'm saying. It says meet me and I was like, okay, press this record. Um, I might be doing this on the last day, not that anybody's surprised, if you know that, you just know I love to submit everything on, like, the last day or two, it's just, oh, so good, because I just don't think about it until they're like, oh yeah, I said all this, sorry guys, but I sent it, and everything's great, I'm sending it right now, I haven't sent it yet, because I'm recording the video, you get what I mean? Um, so, anywho, I'm here to play a good game, play an honest game, um, I'm not gonna be one of those bitches that's going around to, like, every person on the cast making 12 different alliances. Couldn't be me. Could not be me. That's exhausting. Y'all are exhausting if you do that. Um, if you want to be my friends, a friend of mine in the game, or not in the game, you can just talk to me about, like, any music that you like, because I'll probably have an opinion on it. Um, I'll filter my opinion, though. I won't be a bitch. <laughs> um... Also, a huge Survivor fan. I've totally seen every season. Um, and I have, like, a ranking of all the seasons because I'm a nerd. Um, love books, too. Love books. Talk to me about books. I love to read. Love to read. Some of you would think otherwise, considering my grammar. But <laughs> I actually do love books. It's true. Um, but, yeah, that's probably all for now. I'm looking forward very much to meeting everybody in this cast. I love meeting new people in orgs. Um... Or people that I played with before, because, you know, every time you play with someone you know, it's going to be different, at least in my experience. Like, sometimes it's someone who you're, like, not going to be working with. Sometimes you're going to be their number one. It's cool. We'll see what happens. Um, good luck, everybody, and I look forward to meeting you all. Hey, uh, I'm Gianna. I am 35 from Cincinnati, Ohio. I love bowling, singing, cooking, and I'm a huge Power Rangers fan. A lot of the community knows me as like the Pink Ranger fan, so I kind of call myself uh, the Org Community's Pink Ranger. 
anyways, also, I'm a patient access representative at Cincinnati Children's Hospital Medical Center. I've been doing that for about 10 months now. So pretty much what I do is um, I check in patients and I make follow-up appointments in the ortho clinic, orthopedics. For those that don't know, um, I've been in the or community for at least about six years now, um, mainly playing Big Brother orgs. I do. I have started playing a lot more Survivor orgs, but I, I started off playing Big Brother um, and just kind of trying to test myself, testing my ability, seeing what I can and can't do. I feel that I have gotten a lot better with physical comps because I'm more of a mental like word puzzle type stuff, like puzzles, more like that kind of thing. Um, but I like to test myself. I like to see what I can, I can do, see what my strengths and weaknesses are. As a player, I'm going to make as many connections as possible. If need be, I will have a one-on-one -on -one chat with every single person in my tribe or what have you. And at least get something going, see who I can make connections with and who I can't. Then after I make those connections, that's when I'm going to start getting strategic and making these moves and trying to get some alliances going because I'm one that's kind of quiet, you know, or I try to like lay low at first or what have you. Um, and I'm not going to try to do that as much. Like I still kind of want to lay low, but I also want to be active and have people see that I'm here and ready to play and that I'm going to be one that's going to have their back or what have you. Um, I am very excited to play this game. I can't wait to see what's going to happen. I can't wait to see who the cast is going to be and who's going to be on my tribe or what have you. Um, but I'm not afraid to make moves and hopefully I can win some sort of power or advantage or whatever to try to make some moves and maybe, you know, be a hacker, shoot, cause some, you, you know, cause some damage, cause some mischief. You know, you don't really see that from me, but maybe you might. Hey, who knows? But I'm going to tell you all this. I'm going to be the one that will, any type of emotion you see, like, if I'm angry about something, if I'm excited about something, if I'm in tears, you're going to see all that emotion. You're going to see that raw emotion from me because I'm going to give you all an in-depth look of how I'm playing the game and how far I can go. All right, all. Have a good one. Toodles. Love you all. What is up, Inferno Season 2? For those of you who don't know me, my name is Jazzy. I am 26 years old. I use she, her pronouns. I am from Ohio and I work as a bakery clerk. Um, I am so, so grateful to Sean, Jen, Topher, and Mac for casting me this season. I was so excited when I heard Inferno season two was happening again and I was like, I'm absolutely applying. Let's go. I'm ready to, you know, hack the system, hopefully, you know? Um, find some stuff about me um those of you who know me you know i am a huge gleek um and if you want to talk about that that would be rad i love especially anything with diana agron who played quinn for bray so you love her we will get along great um i also am very into besides glee i love i've been very into one tree hill if y'all listen to the drama queens podcast which Hilary Burton, um, Sophia Bush, and Bethany Joy Lenz do. I am always listening weekly, and if you want to, you know, have a party and watch some episodes, I'm always down for something like that. I also really like to pray Little Liars, especially the new reboot, the um, original Sin. Like, that was so good. Um, very into Friends from the 90s. If you like Friends, we can talk about that too. Um, love a lot of comedies like How I Met Your Mother. I'm also a big, hugely into Harry Potter. Um, if you love Harry Potter. I am a Ravenclaw, according to every test I've ever taken. Most people who know me are like, oh no, you're a Hufflepuff. So I call myself a Ravenpuff. Um, what else is there to know about me? Um, I try to be a very positive, bubbly person. And I always enjoy getting to know new friends. So never hesitate to message me because I will absolutely... Be talking back to you and we can have a good old time in this game um i hope this can be a really fun game for everybody let's go season two
What's up everyone? My name is Jonah. I am 26 years old and I am from a little town called Mount Laurel, New Jersey. Um, I am currently a media librarian, which is uh, pretty exciting. Not really, but you know, it's a job and gotta pay the bills somehow. Um, in my free time, I like going to concerts. I like to watch sports since I can't really play them. Um, yeah, with friends and family, you know, normal life things. Um, so it's been a bit since I played an org. Um, almost pretty much almost a year since I played. So getting back to the swing of things, lots of uh, life issues came in the way. Had to stop for a little bit, uh, but now I'm back and hoping this is a, a pretty good distraction from what's going on in the real world right now. Um, but yeah, super excited. Um, I'm excited to, uh, meet new people, um, not exactly sure what I'm getting myself into exactly, um, but yeah, you guys have probably no idea who the, who I am even, so, um, support me if you want, if you don't, go get rocks. just kidding, don't, I'm nice, I promise. Hi, I'm Lauren, I'm 23 years old, I live in Port Washington, um, I like Pokemon. E. Uh, oh. I'm gonna do pretty well this game. As far as we far as I know, I'm super loyal. Uh, I'm always active in challenges. I get I always give a hundred percent in the challenges. Even if I get uh voted out, I don't always give a hundred percent. Of, of the challenges. I'm gonna make big moves. I'm gonna be very sneaky at this game. I'm gonna be uh, chaotic. I'm gonna go mad. I'm gonna go crazy. I'm gonna go crazy for this game. So you better, you better watch out. You better not cry. You better not pout. I tell you why. Laura is going to hunt you down. Okay. Uh, snitches. Hi. My name is Lauren. I'm 31. I'm from South Carolina. I'm an assistant customer service manager at a grocery store. Um, what else can I tell you? I love the color pink. Sorry, I'm kind of at my grandparents' house, so, like, I'm kind of whispering to get this done. Um, so, yeah. Um, I love dogs. I'm a big animal lover. I love playing games. I love doing orgs and all that. And I love meeting people. Because, yeah. So, I'm really excited to play this game. I love Survivor, like, orgs. Those were, like, I don't know, a lot of fun. And yeah, I can't wait to see who's going to be on my tribe and everything. And yeah, let's get going. And yeah, <clears throat> I'm more outgoing than in this video. It's very awkward and weird to just ramble on to myself. So yeah, I'm ready to meet y'all. Hello, uh, I'm Lewis. Uh, I'm 23 years old from the UK, Manchester, if you want to be specific. Um, I use he, him pronouns, and I'm a student, I'm a media performance student uh, at university. Basically, it's like acting, but catered to like TV and radio and shit like that. Anyway, um, on the side, I'm an usher at a theatre, uh, I'm also a, um, uh, Alexa, shut up. I'm also a retail assistant at uh, Manchester United. Alexa, fucking shut up. I'm a retail assistant at Manchester United Football Club um, at the stadium. So yeah, I have my hands in many things because I want to make money 
and I don't make enough money u using one of those jobs, so I'm do doing two jobs that, on top of being a student. It's fucking annoying because I wish I had the one job that could pay me enough to actually live off of... Anyway, anyway, um, I can focus on that after uni and whatnot. Um, I'm just rambling at this point, fucking hell. Uh, what am I like as a player? Uh, fun? Um, like, really, really enjoyable and, like, so, so funny and witty and absolutely amazing and you're all gonna be my bestie and that's that um audience i think you're gonna enjoy me because i'm fun and witty and like really enjoyable and you're gonna love me because of that and shit yeah you're gonna see this intro video and be like how the fuck did this guy get casted <laughs> or cast rather cast casted that's a whole fucking debate that is always on the timeline and it's fucking annoying that people are really that specific about like being cast or casted casted is not english cast is english whatever the fuck whatever i don't give a fuck i'm just gonna say however i want to say it okay um uh, i was told i had like five minutes to record this i'm just rambling i'm just saying utter shit um listen i just hope you all enjoy me and if you don't enjoy me fuck you i don't give a fuck <laughs> no um i'm i'm completely joking um listen i'm just here to have a good time i um don't play many orgs i'm mostly from the twitter mini community so this is completely different to me first of all it's a facebook skype game so i'm not really on this side of the community and it's an org and i haven't played a long term org in over a year so um it's gonna be an experience i'm very rusty at these kind of games but i'm gonna have fun and enjoy it and i can't wait to meet who i'm playing against i um i hope i can go far and i hope that you all fall in love with me that that would be great because then i can win and that would be absolutely amazing if i can win oh my god no i'm i'm totally kidding um i mean of course i want to win i think um anyone who applies for anything in the org community should apply because they want to win um, and if you if you say that you don't want to win, you're lying to yourself. Um, yeah. Okay, I've got like 30 seconds left on this video. I'm just gonna... Alright, bye. Thank you. Uh, sweet. Okay, hi. I am Marvin. I am 28. And, you know, pronouns are he, him. I live in Arkansas, and the reason I'm living in Arkansas is because I'm in the Air Force, I'm stationed here, I've been stationed here for like nine and a half years now. Yeah, so, um, I'm excited to be playing, you know, the second season of Inferno. Um, I did apply last season, and I was an alternate. <laughs> Anyways... Um, well, all that matters is that I'm here now, and yes, I'm filming this in the dark, because, you know, yeah, I just didn't feel like turning on a light, even though I can easily just go flip one on, but I don't want to. But yeah, um, I'm looking forward to seeing who else is going to get cast, you know, be part of this cast and whatnot, and, you know, all I have to say is I gotta do the best I can, and... Yeah, you're either going to love me or you're going to hate me. But either way, I will have fans. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm here to play for me, myself, myself only. I am not playing for you guys, the viewers. So whatever decisions are made are decisions that I want to make and not because the viewers want me to make them. So yeah, um, we shall see what happens. And wish me the best of luck. And you know what? You can be Team Marvin. Or you can't. But anyways. <laughs> um, 
we'll see how this 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 turns out all right bye okay my name is morgan i am 28 um i currently am in orlando florida i moved here at 17. Um, i've been here ever since i started out with the disney college program and have worked at the theme parks um, I'm originally from Houston, Texas. I was born and raised there. Um, I started watching Survivor whenever I was younger and as in my adult life, I just really enjoy it. I enjoy Big Brother, the challenge, all of that. Um, so I thought it would be really fun to um, do this. I've heard a lot about it. So this will be my first like online reality game and I'm really excited to see how it goes and turns out. So yeah, I'm really excited to see how it goes. Uh, don't mind me, just currently going to Disney. Um, but I'm just really excited for the gameplay and to meet all of the players and um, see what's to come. Hi friends. <clears throat> yeah, that was gross. Uh, my name is Nick, I'm 24 years old. I'm currently at a camp, hence the bunk beds. Um, I reside right outside of Dayton, Ohio right now. I really want to play this game because I love orgs. It's one of my favorite things to do in life. Um, which is sad. Kind of really sad. But I really, really enjoy the community that comes with orgs and the... I don't want to say camaraderie because that sounds stupid. Here, I'm gonna get a mop fruit snack because I'm hungry. Um, but I really do enjoy making friends and just the friendship that comes with orgs. I think that it's something that is very unique about this community. Um, and I love, love, love these games. Um... I'm really excited to play. I'm really excited to meet everyone. I think that I have been waiting to play. I don't know what I'm talking about. I just lost my train of thought. Um, but I'm really excited to play. These fucking March fruit snacks slap. Um, I don't really know what else to say. So I'll give y'all a tour. Of what I'm saying. I'm gonna let in here. This is my room. Um, I currently have Survivor hacks on the TV. It's so dark in here. This is the living room. <laughs> um, there's like two other bedrooms that aren't used right now. And then my bathroom. So slay. Um, but anyways. Oh, that's done and over with. Oh, it's so dark you can't see me. I'm sorry. Now that that's done and over with, um, yeah, I'm really excited, excited to play. I'm super stoked, super ready. And I can't wait to see you guys. Hi, Inferno Season 2 watchers and fellow players. How are you? My name is Susie. I am 31 years old. I am a September Virgo and I live in Kissimmee, Florida, but I am from Williamsburg, Virginia. I moved down to Florida nine years ago this June and I moved down to do my Disney College program internship. Ever since then, I have worked at Disney. I've had a lot of different jobs there. But currently, I work for Disney Fairy Tale Weddings as a planning assistant in our offices. And I love it so, so much. Um, and yeah. So, as far as orgs go, I have played others. I played a Survivor org over this summer. Got, uh, and then. I played Big Brother Disney season seven in the fall. And then I played a Halloween themed uh, sequester mini. That was really fun. But I'm really excited to play Inferno. 
So yay. I also have had the chance to meet so, so many people in the org community, which has been really fun. Um, I started watching Sequester in 2020. That's where I watched Prod Jen and her husband fall in love. And ever since then, I watched Jen continue to play more orgs. And then eventually I started playing and here we are. Everybody in the community is so, so great. And yeah, I love Big Brother and the challenge and I actually don't watch Survivor but maybe eventually one day. I watch other reality TV shows. I also like The Bachelor, Bachelorette, and I am a sucker for The Real Housewives. But like reality TV is about the only like cable television I really watch anymore. Other than that, it's like streaming. Isn't that crazy? I used to watch so much more cable TV. Anywho, what else? I have a dog named Benny. He is a mini chocolate lab mix. He is sleeping right next to me. And tomorrow is his sixth birthday. So that is fun. I love him so much. Most of the time you'll find me at home chilling on my couch with him snuggling next to me. But I also love going to Disney sometimes when it's not too hot. I enjoy playing tennis. I love photography. I, oh, he's just so cute. I love cooking. Um, what else? I love just laying by the pool, my pool. I love traveling. Um, and yeah, I'm trying to think of anything else that's fun. I'm kind of lame. I am a grandma and it's past my bedtime, but you know what? For orgs, I stay up past my bedtime, but tonight Mm -mm -mm, because tomorrow, fun fact, I have jury duty. So that should be fun. I love scrolling TikTok too. That's the other thing. Anyway, follow me on social media if you'd like. Susie underscore Easton. Basically everything on everything. And yeah, I love avocados and sushi and Cosmos and a glass of Prosecco. Okay, well, so excited to play with you all. Thanks for watching. Bye. Hi, I'm Tanner. I mean, you You've, um, I, I, th I think you've seen me everywhere. I hope I make this my best game, and I'm glad to see new faces. and like see who's playing. All right, hello everyone. Um, I'm Tommy, I'm coming to you live from my car as I will tend to do for most things this season. Um, I am 30 years old, which when I say out loud does feel a little bit too old for me to be doing this, but here we are. Um, I'm a fifth grade teacher from Raleigh, North Carolina, um, and I currently have a very bad cough, so if you get annoyed watching this video because I keep coughing all the time, um, no harm, no foul. I'm currently stopped at a red light, so everyone is looking at me, which is super awkward. Uh, but I'm an influencer, so I get it. 
Um, okay, so a couple of things about me. Um, I'm not a very experienced orger in the sense that I've only played one org two times, and that was Big Brother Hometowns, where I came in 14th and 6th. So in addition to not being experienced, I'm also not very good. Um, and I was gonna say I do these for fun, but both times I played towards the end, I ended up having a miserable time, except for the time I came in 14th. The time I came in 6th was literally awful for the entire last week of the game. Um, but I digress. Um, let's see. I play a lot of sports outside of this. I'm, I'm also into Dungeons and Dragons, so like my weeknights are a little bit super busy, um, which is not going to bode well for me in this game. On top of the fact that if there's one thing you need to know about me, it's that I will go to sleep. Like, I will be in bed. And that's fine. That's like kind of uh, where I'm going to get my strategy for this season is like... I'm not gonna be up until two, three in the morning strategizing like, no, like let's get it done during daylight hours and then go to sleep normally. Like if you watch the show Survivor, like they go to sleep and like no one's talking while they're sleeping. And if they do, well, maybe those people go on to win the game and maybe that just won't be me and that's fine. That's fine. I do imagine that I'll be there for a good time and not a long time, uh, which is an interesting way to feel going into a game, but I'm just very realistic in the fact that um, I'm not good and I don't want to labor over... <laughs> this is awful. <coughs> I don't want to labor over this game and make it a miserable experience for me because then I've cut everything else out of my life, so I don't... Um, I don't know. Anyway, my strategy is... Um, Normally, like, I try to be, like, very social and it takes me a long time to get into game talk with people just because I never know, like, the right amount to, like, push game talk. Um, so normally I'll still be talking about, like, personal things and no game, like, a week and a half into the game with some people and, like, that I don't think is going to fly. Um, especially when, you know, two or three days into this game you're going to vote somebody out. So my strategy is to be a little bit more direct obviously still be like the super sweetheart that i am um but just be more direct and be like hey listen like super happy to get to know you like really do want to play this game together if it's somebody that i like if i don't like them i'm not gonna do it um i lost my train of thought oh yeah but <coughs> um and kind of make my allies that way. Like they know like I'm fully here to talk game with you, bounce ideas back and forth. And then like once we have a plan, like then we can do all of that nice like, oh my God, how are you? Like how many dogs do you have? Like how many cats do you have? Because like everyone always wants to know. And do you have any siblings? Like what do you do for work? Like that stuff to me like can kind of come secondary, which again, I don't think is gonna bode well for me, but I do wanna try it because it's the complete opposite of what I normally do. Um, and obviously I have yet to win, so we're gonna try switching something up. But I'm super excited to play. It is my first Survivor game, so I don't fully understand. <coughs> Jesus. <coughs> I don't fully understand like Survivor pacing. I barely understand Big Brother plays like pacing, having played twice. I assume it's more fast paced with people constantly talking because especially if your tribe loses, you're like always on the block to go home. And so like, that'll be new for me. Um, but if you win, like, then you can just, like, shoot the shit and, like, decide what you're gonna do next time you lose, so. Um, I do expect to do, like, decent in challenges. I'm never really, like, the winner of the challenge, but I'm always, like, kind of, like, up there. So I think that that'll be good in a survivor format where, like, I can at least help my tribe to win. But I'm super excited to play. Um, I do like playing these games, meeting new people. Um, but like I said, I'm not really gonna be interested in, like, the meeting and getting to know people part of this, so. We'll see how it goes, and um, root for me or don't. I don't care either way. Um, but yeah, uh, I will. I don't know how to end this.